everyone, today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the BenQ. This is their screen bar halo monitor light webcam accessory. I did receive this sample, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product or you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and see what's inside. Here are all the contents. It's just two pieces for the stand. We have our base plate right here that's magnetic and it has a sticky back on it. We can peel that for installation. Then we have our second piece you're looking at right there with a nice felt cover. And then everything else is just gonna be hard textured plastic. And again, magnetic, so you get the idea. There's no product literature because the instructions are right there on the side of the box. So you can follow those instructions right there. Now let's go ahead, let's get everything set up and installed. All right, so we have our BenQ Screen Bar Plus right here where we can attach our webcam accessory. So for this particular light, we have a flat spot here, then it angles up. So we can attach this plate here to make full contact or anywhere up until about that point, then it angles up. So then we could attach it here with a slight overhang that wouldn't be making contact, but we'd have a majority of it fastened firmly in place. So we have a couple different options here to there or up there. There's not gonna be enough contact with the adhesive if we put it right there at the angle and the flat surface. But I do wanna point out, if you're not gonna be super mobile, it's gonna be very stationary where you just set it up and forget about it. With this particular light, the magnet appears strong enough that right here, we could actually just use it as is. But that kind of falls apart if you're gonna be, you know, fidgeting with this. You gotta make sure it supports itself under its own weight. And then if you wanna like make adjustments here, you know, it could tip back. So if the gravity's right and you have it where you want it, you could get away with just installing your webcam like that. But basically, depending on your webcam, this is a Logitech Brio. We have a couple mounting points. It has a really nice stand here. Fantastic, fantastic option if you're looking for a webcam. But we could just mount it like that. You could fold that in but a lot of contact points there for us to rest up on the accessory and also to mount to the back side. Let me show you that from the side. There's that side look for you there, but you get the idea. So less permanent, but it's gonna be, you know, top heavy if you wanna use it without the plate or you could fasten it with the plate to have a more permanent option, depending again on your screen bar and if it supports any magnet on its own or if you have to use the included plate. More permanent, still removable, keep everything secure, or for some reason you have a stronger magnet, you wouldn't have to use the adhesive back if you don't want, but you can have it installed just like that on your screen bar. So this is a simple and straightforward product that just works, but let me share with you my final thoughts. There's a couple things I'd wanna see improved with this webcam accessory in the future. The first one, give us a threaded connector. That would be awesome. So add a little thread here, so then we can go ahead and add our cameras that way. Female threaded option right there at the top would be great. Secondly, not as big of a deal, but give us a stronger magnet, so maybe we don't have to even stall this plate to begin with. We could just zap it right there on our monitor. Not that big of a deal, but I'd love to see the threaded connector and bonus points for that stronger magnet, so we could just slap it right on without even having to use this plate. 